right, guys. It's time to make the donuts. First things first. Morning routine. So a lot of you told me before the surgery that we really needed to find one of these little cold water circulating machines. And it was difficult to get one down here to Columbia, but so many of y'all were adamant about it. We paid the extra shipping cost, we jumped through the hoops, and we got it here. So now we're going to show you a little bit about how it works and how awesome Kurt is. Each morning he gets up and he freshens the ice so that we can do a, a short little ice cycle before I even get up in the morning. Because we've learned over the past week that the first 30 minutes of the day are kind of critical to how the day's going to go. And we need today to go good. Well, and also if we keep the swelling down, it makes things a lot better too. Yeah, yeah. And I don't know, maybe something about the first morning, the blood flow through going first thing in the morning. We've learned that we need to stretch it all the way out and maybe let it run for a minute or two. Get all the air bubbles out and all the water going. And then I'm going to strap that little pad right there on my knee. And the cold water just runs through there. And it is an amazing little rock star, isn't it, Kurt? Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one comes every morning for her little morning snuggle time. <laughs> and just like that, she's gone. What are you doing, pretty girl? What are you doing, pretty girl? And, uh, what are you doing? So the morning routine actually starts the night before. Kurt sets me up with a water bottle, uh, mixed up orange drink water, a couple of bags of nuts or a granola bar in case I get hungry. And uh, then we do the best we can to get a good night's sleep. Before we start the morning routine that we're showing you guys now. Time to make the coffee. Did a nice 30 minute ice cycle with this nice little machine and I know you guys are going to ask. So it's called a Cool Man. We got it off of Amazon. It does have little glitches. You do have to baby it a little bit. 
Um, we read all of the reviews to learn the tricks to how to keep it flowing. It is good. It works. We don't make any money from selling it, but if you've got a knee surgery, a hip surgery, or a shoulder surgery coming up, get one. All right, guys. <laughs> one thing with my new short hair is it sure gets poofy. But it is shower time, and we have a nice big shower that I can stand up in pretty easy. And we got lucky. They have nice, sturdy chairs that were on the balcony here. So we just drug one of those in here to the shower. Now, I'm going to do y'all a favor and not show y'all me taking a shower. <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. All right, coffee's made. I got my coffee black, Snow's coffee, cream and Splenda, and her oatmeal has cinnamon, raisins, almonds, and Splenda. And look at my yummy breakfast over here. So I'm gonna put the potatoes in there, but I have bacon, onions, peppers, potatoes are going in there, and then I also have some eggs that are gonna go on top. So yummy. I popped the potatoes in there. Look at that, guys, that's gonna be good. The bacon is thick, it's crisping up. I like that. Shower's done. Bed is halfway made. Kurt's been handling that kind of stuff for us, which is awesome. I'm about to move to the living room, to start my new location for the day. Maybe do a little editing, uh, do a little bit of work for you guys. And uh, let's go eat some breakfast. There she comes, guys. She's a walking machine. <laughs> walking, walking. Watch this. Don't show off. Don't all show all off. <laughs> no showing no, off. It's too early to get it all poofed up. There it is. How awesome is Kurt? He's got my leg prop chair, my coffee, my oatmeal, my pillows, and my computer, all within a three foot radius. All right, I'm going to settle in, guys. As you can see there, my skillet breakfast, potato, bacon, onions, peppers, all goes in this bowl. Now we got to put a couple fried eggs on top. Alright, so G Money wasn't going to be outdone with a little morning cuddle session that Banna gave me earlier. He just jumped up here to snuggle. Kurt is winding up his skillet breakfast. I'm all settled in. About to eat my oatmeal. And wait on Kurt. We're going to have breakfast together right here. Here we go, guys. Complete breakfast. It's not real healthy, but it's real good. <laughs> No down. That means I gotta do all the chores, and one of them is take out the trash. This morning, you saw a typical start to our day, but today is not a typical day. We are going in for my first post-op doctor's appointment with the orthopedic surgeon. Today could mean getting this big bandage off and getting rid of the stitches and kind of getting a, a good first all clear from the doc. So we're going to take you with us. Let's go see my surgeon.
locals. Yes. guys look at miss independent going she's going like crazy unassisted out of the cart didn't even use the yellow elastic band no no band she is moving along but once we get inside oh, we are going to use a wheelchair because it's a long walk as beautiful as you are you just don't know how far in this world be right by your side with arms even if you don't want you wrote your name in my Over here in the corner in the waiting room. Waiting on Stephanie to meet us here and get us all checked in. And then uh, hopefully we have our appointment with Dr. Pardo. Are you nervous at all? I just really want these stitches out, but it's gonna hurt when they take them out. But I don't even care because I just want them out. You think they're coming out today? I hope so. This is the first time we get a look at it. Yeah, we haven't seen the scar at all yet. So. Just that's a big thing to see what kind of icky scar I'm gonna have on my knee. But I don't even care about that either. Look who's here. All right, so Stephanie's here helping us because we're in the Medellin Hospital and she's amazing and that's what she does. But I'm getting a little excited because I think I'm supposed to get this off today. So um, it's been a while that it's been on here. We haven't seen this thing yet. So today's a big day, guys. Stephanie's going to be here to help us through. Yeah. Whoa. Don't worry, be happy. Don't worry. No, <laughs> don't worry. Be... No, it's all good. The good doctor says, don't worry, be happy. Wow. Perfect. How pretty. Yeah. Okay, let me see. Whoa. Perfect. You you pick. You know? No, no, you do not. You can move your bed. Sit, sit. And please. Okay, bed. Okay. Um, please good. Um, the chair or something. That's about it. Very good. Very good. The skin is is well. Total strength. One week with that. Then one week. Then 
We need a basket. Okay, I ordered one. This side. I walk a little over here. Okay. okay. Cut your leg. And leg coming down. Walk every day, every all day. day, okay? Okay. Every day, all day. La idea está perfecta. Luego, en un momento, pasan donde la enfermera para quitar dos puntos. Oh. Para hacer la curación. Wow! Wow! Thank you so much. Great job, doctor. Wow! For dental work in the future? No. no? Okay. No. Okay. I just wanted to ask. Okay. okay. So is the risk for infection over then? Ya no hay riesgo de infección. Sí. Sí. Showers, everything, I'm okay. Now. To all quitan los puntos, de 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 es 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 Go. Stitches go, okay? And tomorrow you can wash. Okay. The stitches go today. Let's get oh. today. We go today. And you can clean and tomorrow. wash it tomorrow. But no, no more. No more bandage? No. No. Yes. In case of dolor, acetaminophen. Doles. Paracetamol. Okay? The same. Sí, the same. Two. Two pills. Two, 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 two. Okay. 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 All right, so now what you got to say? I don't know. I'll tell you in a minute. The stitches are about to come out, guys. What do you got to say? No. Nothing? Go to look. Are you nervous? Yes, a little bit. It's easy to say. We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, playful and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl, daydreamer, looking at me. Take me back, all the way back. All right, we're having a little feast here, a little celebration. Having us a yummy, yummy dinner. Got some nice steaks with some mushroom, onions, and garlic. And then we have a little yellow squash with onion. I made a fresh cream of mushroom yeah. soup. And we have some nice little fingers of crusted, butter crusted bread to dip it in. It's so. gonna be so good. Right I'm about to dig in. <laughs> Which means this guy right here needs to get kicked out of my chair. <laughs> and here's little Miss Princess. Hanging out with me. Hi, baby. <laughs> Good morning guys. So yesterday we took you to the first post-operation appointment with my orthopedic surgeon. It went well. He was very pleased with the movement I could do, almost 90 degrees. Uh, he did give me some instructions that by next week he wants me off the walker and on the cane, which is good that I already ordered a cane and it should be here soon. Um, they pulled out the stitches, which 
There were a few that were embedded pretty good and it was a little bit painful, but it feels really awesome to have them out. It feels really good to have that big bulky bandage off. Uh, my surgeon was very happy with the way the incision looked and the, that I didn't have a ton of swelling. So all in all, it was a good day. And now tomorrow, tomorrow is another big day. I've been doing my at-home physical therapy with Santiago, but tomorrow I have my first physical therapy checkup at the hospital uh, where we'll see what the hospital staff thinks about that and Santiago will be going with us. So Fabian, our driver, will meet us here in the morning. Santiago will meet us here. We will all load up into Fabian's car, drive to the hospital for my first physical therapy session at the hospital. I've had many. You guys know that. You've seen it. But so yesterday, big day that went good. Hopefully tomorrow is another big day that goes good. A little bit of a pain update. It kind of comes and goes, the level. Doing pretty good, but seems like if I sleep a little crooked on it or something, I have a rough start to the day, which is what's going on today. So I don't know if it's how I slept on it or if that we did a lot yesterday with the trip to the hospital and getting the stitches out and stuff like that. But all in all, things are going awesome. We'll see you guys in the morning when we get ready to go to the first hospital physical therapy where I think they'll probably make me bend my knee as far as I have. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you guys know when we put out new videos. And don't forget, you can always follow us over on Instagram to see what's going on in between videos. Cheers, guys!